So this is our stats. We've died four times. Uh, and I've done all the challenges. But now I have new ones to do. So we have the tank now. And cursed. But we did everything else. Pony streak was crazy. And then we just unlocked Lilith. I don't remember how Lilith worked. We got you. Do it. Oh, no. Boy, that one was crazy. All right, my hand's still shaking. Ugh. Uh, if any of you guys remember, like, the last time you had a game that just had you, like, really so pumped up or nerved, like, crazy, feel free to let me know. Because I probably want to play that game. It was a great experience. I don't know if you guys know about Escape from Tarkov. It's a very... It is a scary game. Very fun. If you play solo, it's really scary. That's what I mostly play as. So greed run, yeah, so it is afterbirth. So afterbirth adds greed, um, the characters, some items, and probably some challenge runs. And then when I get back to a uh, thousand one percent, which is completed the base game and all of afterbirth, I will get repentance, which is the final DLC. So this is my road to repentance. Which I might call it from now on, because that sounds way better. Risk of Rain 2, I remember we, we talked about that yesterday. So, you just find out prefer Risk of Rain 2. This is an okay item. So, you can see it's going to pull our stuff. So, basically, wherever we're aiming, it's a lot, a lot more accurate. So I'm pretty blind on a lolly. I don't know what's really in the DLC. I, I think there's some like I saw somebody playing it and I was like, is this modded? Is this the base game? You know? And I'm trying to just keep that blind for myself. Not that I mean you can feel free to share items and things like that. I think it'll be more interesting if I'm really, you know, back to being good at this and then get just like Will Smith at the Oscars slapping that dude. <laughs> You know, by the, by the Repentance DLC. We have a lot of red HP on the ground, so I might take a hit on one. Purpose just to speed this up. Also, I kind of want to activate Horror Babylon. So, instead of half a red heart, um, Horror Babylon activates at one for Eve only. And we also have the bird there. Well, there's some damage. Still gonna pick up the HP. Just in case I get hit, hit, and die. I would rather lose the devil deal and live. So I guess I try to play this with the idea that I want every run to be a win, right? Not that you don't, but I'll take I'll take items I shouldn't still. In lieu of a good time. Oh, no key written. Right? No. You could probably bomb and then have to get one more bomb. I protect the devil deal here. I'm not super confident in my damage. Let's see if I can get a key. I get a bad jump here. There it is. But this is okay. We don't completely lose our double deal if we still don't get hit on the boss. And it's red heart damage, so I'm basically doing this to try to find something to protect my red heart to let me get hit on the boss. Will Smith slapping the man is just me slapping the buy button. Oh, absolutely. It's... It, one of the reasons I like it so much is just the value, right? I think the base game was like $15, and you can just play it for a long time. Um, I, let me check. I have I have 355 hours. So I'm, I'm, I like to be frugal. So a big $60 AAA purchase for me is 
pretty tough. Something like Hades. I don't know if you've played Hades. That is, again, I think it's like $20 or less uh, USD. And it is really fantastic value. Yeah, so essentially, essentially all, it's like you played it an hour a day for a month. Do you have a character that you prefer, a character you hate? So what I'm going to do here is, since we've already taken a hit, right, I'm going to go through this. You get an that's Curse of the Tower. Hmm. Uh, I'll just, this is what I was saying earlier, right? I'll take anything. So you'll see that it's going to spawn bombs whenever we get hit. But we want to stay at a low red HP, so it's kind of going to be bad. This is okay. That's worse. I think that's soy milk. That's not very good. I'm going to try to come back with more. Hopefully I'll get money. If not, I'll take it. I should just take it. I don't have- there's no way I'm going to get something else. The only option I could have done else was put down Judgment and also blow up Judgment. I like Eve. Um, I feel like you get a good, strong start, and you're almost at an advantage to get rid of your HP and Devil Deals. Me and Isaac, like, I'll just basically say Devil Deal, Devil Deal. Like, that is, that is your priority. Oh, that's really lucky. Pentagram damage. And then there's flying, so. We would have died uh, if not for the, the black hearts. And so I picked them all up at the same time, and that's why I lived. So we did take that, that, that. Nothing to fly over. We are just. So, because of what I just showed you with the old animation thing. Like that instance of we would have just killed ourselves trading two red for two red. Um, but picking up the soul hearts during that animation keeps you alive. So you can do that and use that to do some stuff. It's a trick for your back pocket. So it may not always work in a situation. Like I would basically want to test like if you see... I think it's the book of like Satan or something. Instead of the, the book of Rev, which gives you a, a soul heart, it gives you a black heart, which is the what, what I have right now. Really good. Um, but if you were to pick it up, creating your last HP for it, and use it, I don't know if it would kill you before you could use the book, right? If it doesn't, you live. I'm gonna blow up this rock too. So blowing up rocks is a chance you'll get little rock. Not little rock. The rock. Like the rock Johnson. Uh, and it's a damage up. So damage up, devil deals. Didn't get our item yet. So we're gonna go back for it. We can get an HP up as our item. We might get one from the boss, but we want to guarantee we get one. Because if we get a devil deal and we can't trade. It's sad. Yeah, this you're exactly right, right? So we, what we were talking about earlier, Azazel is strong because on the first floor you have flying, you've got damage. But, I mean, like this room, this room would be really scary. I'm going to get hit. Especially with an enemy that shoots out like that, a uh, champion version. It's going to be hard to guess that projectile, and like guessing that it's always there about to hit you is going to have me playing super paranoid. But I love speedrunning. Uh, pretty much in any game, probably. Um, but I have to really have like 100% of the game before I, I would ever try something like that. And Isaac is the only game where I've ever felt good enough to try to go fast. Hmm... That golden chest is not worth it. It's fine. We don't take damage. Keeps I not gonna do a ton for us, but once in a while you're gonna see it line up. Money. Oof. 
very dark there. So Iris are about see they're below the ground, I still hit them. Really important. Take those shots anyway. Neon white or oh neon white Oreo? Oreo or Pizza Tower? Oh neon white. Oh, oh neon white. I know what that game is. It's like a speedrunning car game or something. I remember I think that came out a couple months ago. Gotcha, gotcha. The Emperor's gonna take us straight to the boss. The one I'm gonna try. Ooh. Okay, we're gonna put down a judgment right. So items are based on the room it's in. So if you do stop in the devil deal, we roll it. Pretty spicy. Here's our HP up we want. Okay, we're gonna take the strength card, because we can actually steal with that. Strength's gonna give us an HP up, so that'll let us take a red heart. We're gonna go away after. That was that was not gonna know. Oh, uh, that's alright. Great, we got some bombs. Just being careful because those can spawn enemies, so I'm just being ready to get so, Emperor we're going to come back for after we put the boss. Double deal. The size of your tiers indicate your damage, right? So you can see they're getting pretty pretty big. Yeah, pretty good damage. If you look at 7.5, pretty good. But what's good on one floor isn't good on another. I'm trying to get my attack fly in. Again, just the projectiles are my number one fear. Uh, and since this is a champion peep, that's why both of his um, eyes are already out. It's honestly pretty confusing, because I don't... Mine and his are all out. But attack fly doing a lot for us. Again, just think cube of meat. Fly the same. Like... Okay. Joker? Nice. Look at that. <laughs> Joker. So, here's what we do. We do this. This will keep the door open. Now we take strength. Now we take this. So, now we can go back get our Emperor card. Teleport straight to the boss on the next floor. That will do it. Which we're not going to do, so we don't have HP for it. And I'd probably do it in the womb. Womb 1 being the best. I like being able to break this game. Oh yeah, speedrun deck builder. Thanks for letting me know, Will. And then so Goathead's gonna guarantee that we get a double deal every time. Okay, since we don't have any red hearts, this will give us soul hearts. I just love unlock. Very satisfying. I don't want to kill that guy. If there's a rug, you should generally bomb the rug. So that's Ipecac right there, what he's doing. That's how Ipecac works. Two of spades. Oh, so I'm just going to use that. This Depending on what I got, I probably wouldn't have skipped it, but wasn't excited. Hope we get the HP up. Nope, the damage is fine. Uh, that's not good enough. Damage. I don't know. I'm gonna take a sip. Since our tears are going to stay alive in Tractor Beam, I think it's going to synergize well. Hopefully we can get a Teleport and Steal. Excellent. Done. I used to watch people speedrun this game. 
so good. Spear shot, help me out. Tractor beam, pretty good. Working out for it. That took a weird bounce there, sir. Oh, is that that's rubber cement, not if attack, but I'll still take it. It's gonna be fun. I'm just looking for our shop. We have so much money. Here's the key. Expecting greed. Nope. nope. Presence okay. More options is really good to go. Gear shot definitely gonna work. Robertsman's just going to keep our shots on the field. Algus is great. Come back for it. Interesting. Fine. There's a tinted rock. We're not going to go to the next. Not helpful. Hangman gives you flying. Okay. Back to that. We look pretty good though. You were really lucky a few days ago. Three guppy items? Oh, and cricket tag. Oh man, that's that's probably I actually had that combo. I can't remember what challenge we did. It was very, very fun. You just you're the danger, right? Everything's locked in there with you. I'm gonna double my money and donate. And um, I'm gonna go back to my resist card. This is a pretty cool build. It's super safe, all your shots are getting utilized. I always think of it as like damage per second, right? So every tier that you're shooting, if you're missing, you're not doing damage. If you're not shooting, you're not doing damage. This cures both. You're clear everything. Another card, sorry. Ah, we see. Imagine that was the last one shot. Hello. So it's actually insane. It's better than quad shot. It's quad shot four in a row. It's like an assault rifle.
Okay, this is literally the best boss we could possibly have for this. Look at that. Brutality. <laughs> Range up, great. Brimstone, I'm gonna pass. Not in I'm gonna do this though. Damage and range. Real boy, oh boy. And this whole time we're we're horror of Babylon Eve. We could even afford to pick up one at heart, which is usually not a luxury you get. We need tears up basically, we just want to fire faster. Is there anything in here worth like what if Oh yeah. No, I appreciate you coming through. Thank you so much for the follow, it means the world to me. Hope I get to talk to you again sometime and have a good good rest of your day. I really appreciated that. Yeah, we're cooking with something here. Ah, and this is a rare time I'll do that. Oh man, look at that boss. That was so funny. We're about to be maxed out on HP. Maggie's not gonna go like this. <laughs> Eve is great. <laughs> I'm not even gonna bomb those, but again, always recommend. Well, now I will. I always recommend bombing the HP. Okay, that's. <laughs> there you go. All stats up. And normally that would be a tough call, since we're Eve, it's no problem. We're not gonna lose our damage on speed. Pretty funny. I guess Isaac's kind of like Dark Souls in the fact that like the game just beats you down all the time, right? So you're just waiting. You're waiting for your turn. Two of spades. Battery body's not gonna help me. Tank for seven cents. Can't pass up. And there we go. Or did damage up. So we'll also get more challenge enemies. I call them champions. I want that. Favorite piece of clothing? Oh, hmm. That's a good question. I, I think I'd have to... Well, do you categorize shoes as clothing? How would you how would you accessorize that or categorize it? Because uh, since since I'm a skateboarder, um, shoes are the world to me. I also if you you know you know all the the health stuff, right? You you want to have shoes that work so you're not hurting your body more than you have to. And there's is that our third needle. Yep. So we're spun. I'm gonna hold. At random. Wait. Game jump? I'll take that. So, I mean, I guess I'll take it just because we can get HP. Like, I don't want to waste HP. Like, getting strong armed here. Anything, yeah. So, I have, I have some black jeans that I really love. And I have them like cuffed up at the bottom. Oh, I'm pretty short. I'm 5'4. So I have to like roll my pants up. But it's now it's like the style, right? They do it so it's fine. 
Um, so that, and I like, I have some fun socks, like I have some llama socks, stuff like that. If they're llamas wearing fun glasses. So I like my, my long fun socks with my rolled up pants and some shoes. Gator shoes. Bombs are oh, key. I wish, I, I'd rather have the bombs. So here in the womb, we're going to take a whole heart of damage, so we need to be more careful. You can get like attrition here, you know. You have a piece of clothing you pick, you know, out that you would say yourself. Something that you will appreciate. I also really like my jacket. A pajama. It's also a blanket, so it warms up when you sit down. So in winter you're not cold. That sounds really comfy. I found pills. So it's pajamas. It's also a blanket. I do. I do like my sweatpants. They're in the washer right now. Now jail free card. I don't remember. I think this opens up the doors. Okay, we'll take that. We're gonna re-roll. Double dark one, normally probably pretty scary because again the lasers. Nasty slam got me. Okay, so our devil deal, we're gonna save the, the re-roll. Guppy's fall. We only have one guppy peak, right? So that's not. There it is. That's why you do it, greed. I'm so greedy. So rubber tears plus brimstone plus quad shot. So I just want to shoot off the walls now, right? Oh, weird. What a weird interaction. Just so crazy. <laughs> Okay, so you can curve it. I gotta figure out how this works. Oh, hello. Welcome. I'm playing Eve for the first time. Not, not ever, you know. I've never played the game. Pretty good. Pretty good build. <laughs> Oh, it's only twenty dollars. Or I was talking about earlier. I like frugal. So it's comfy and and frugal, and it's your favorite. Look at that. Top marks from me. We've got Bill. We've got Bill. This this just yeah, it's almost first phase. And we have Godhead, so we're gonna be able to go to, to the goal for sure. Normally, you'd end right here. So this is perfect. Go, babe. And there's Ipecac. We were talking about it. There's how to spell it. Now we can pick it up. Scary room. Ooh, scarier. Now it's scary. I was trying to get past the lasers and the bombs are coming. Pretty good. So I wonder, let's test here, because I'm pretty confident in my build. Can I reopen this in a jail free person? I was wondering if it would let me skip this. My goodness. Ivo's friend Lolly came through earlier. Very cool. 
also just had a we just had a chat about it. This is one of those very satisfying builds. Feels feels earlier i can't remember what it was but leviathan is just um i'm gonna actually we're so strong we can get there i'm gonna keep strength for the boss i'm gonna reroll that oh i can't put it back down i'm a fool i could have kept re-rolling They just really want me to... Uh, so it's quad shot, brimstone, um, and then um, rubber, rubber cement makes it to where it bounces off the walls so it doesn't go away. I just don't want to go too far from my card. So damage up right there. How dare you touch me, Satan? I'm better than you. <laughs> Pretty good combo. So Dill, are you working? What you up to? I agree with you, Ivo. After what I just experienced, I too love Brimstone. 